Hi everyone, welcome to another Greenleaf Terrain studio update on the Mini Wargaming 40k table. I have just to spray the couple buildings here, there is uh, the two parts of the cathedral behind me. And I'm going to get that sprayed up today. But I have all the smaller pieces finished, the two crashes, four ruin walls, the three bridges, five rubble pieces and four craters. So I'll just zoom in and uh, I'll show uh, the different pieces here. So starting with these craters, I just went for a uh, blackened crater. Dave said he wanted it to be look like all this stuff had recently happened, so blackened out craters. That one's a double bomb. And then I filled two of these guys with a little bit of mud. Uh, muddy um, water effects and then you have the oh, uh, rubble piles, I need to refocus on this guy so then we have the five rubble piles here they just have various uh, concrete slab pieces in them a uh, whole bunch of just bent metal and stuff some of them have uh, bits of uh, what are they called? The Aegis defense line there. So starting with this rune bridge, just like a concrete look. I've uh, rusted up all the metal and we got some uh, grime streaking going down everywhere. Just a great to that guy. Got them all painted up, grime streaking on the inside. It's the same thing with this guy. Got the grime streaking on there. Concrete look. Faded in spots. And there's different grays uh, sprayed onto the. Uh, it's a trio of grays for the concrete and a trio of grays for the uh, the ground. And then there's some burn marks where this one has been blown out. And we have the fall of the four uh, broken ruin uh, ruined wall sections here. There's the little small guys. Add a little bit of cover. It's got a little bit of. Uh, bullet holes, cracked concrete, rubble, and uh, each one has a few bands and rivets with rusted uh, metal on them. Here's the uh, crashed out land speeder. I painted up all the uh, vehicles in Blood Angels because I was going to do Ultramarines. Ultramarines is more like the generic Space Marines, but Dave plays Blood Angels, so I decided to uh, destroy lots of his Blood Angels here. It's all ruined up. All this, uh, grab this guy here. Sit him back there. All that uh, front part's all airbrushed up with a few, about three or four grays and a brown color. Finally, we have the uh, blown out. Uh, Blood Angels Land Raider here. Lots of uh, chip paint, rusted, uh, rusted parts, blackened the uh, uh, smokestacks back there. And then I have a little Necron guy coming out there. I'll zoom in on him in a sec here. So there's my little Necron guy coming out there. I've rusted him up. Same way, I use the same weathering patterns that I rusted all the other stuff up with. Uh, gave him some green glowing eyes and a little bit of object source lighting around the glow. He looks really cool coming out, crawling out of there. He doesn't have a hand. <laughs> so just the other side of the piece, just more uh, bolt holes and rusting, and get some concrete built up at the back here. I'll have still pics of this on my Facebook. So if you check out my Facebook page, we'll have still pics of everything up on there. So I apologize right now, but I am in the process of getting more lights. Uh, I need to get some umbrella lights that I can stick kind of standing up behind me here because I don't have enough lighting on the walls and there's no overhead lighting. So I'm going to get these ran over to Mini Wargaming and uh, hopefully I can get in some good lighting there and I'll take still pics of these there. So thank you for watching. I'll have a video of all the buildings uh, airbrushed up probably in the next two days. 
And thank you for watching again. Please subscribe, and I'll have more videos to come.